Hi, this is practice for beginner French horn players who are playing on the F horn. So let's take a deep breath together. Work with me. Here we go. Just release it under a little bit of pressure, not too much. Like that. All right. Do a little buzz if you can. Get the lips working. Now put the mouthpiece up to your, up to the lips. Find the right spot for it. Make sure it's exactly like I put it. All right. Very important. All right. Now we're going to play the note C. All right. Here we go. Play with me. Find the note. I'll play for a little while. See if you can get the same pitch. Lots of repetition, nice steady note, air pressure is very even. This is what we're trying to achieve. It takes a while to do this when we start. Now if you're playing a different note, if you can hear a different pitch, then we'll try and work out what it is. On the F horn, in the middle of the range, we have four different pitches you might be playing. That was a C. Here's an E. So if you had that sound while I was playing my C, you were playing an E. What about if you were playing a bit higher? It was probably this one. That's a G. C E G. And if you're playing a low note, that's also fine. And it might be this one. So those four notes on the F horn without pushing any vowels down are right in the middle of our range. Low G, C, E, G. All right. So now we're going to move, move some of the vowels. We're going to use the middle vowel. Can you see how this... One here is connected to this valve here, valve two, and the slide, this is the smallest slide, so it makes the pitch go down a semitone. C, B. Play with me. C, B. Ready? Now if you got higher notes, you'd be getting E, D sharp. If your notes were even higher, it'd be G, F sharp. Let's try C, B again. Play with me. C, B here. Join in. And if you had the low ones, that'd be low G and F sharp. do one more today. Let's do C, B flat. First valve that's connected to this slide here. Twice as long as the other. Goes The pitch goes down a tone. Now if you've played and you got this sound and went to D, what happened was you actually increased your air pressure. So try and keep it very even and let the valve work for you. If you start on an E, you'd go down to a D. Try that with me. E, D. And if you were playing higher, you'd be getting a G and we'd go down to an F. Or low G. It doesn't matter which of these you start on. I played all of those because often beginners start on different notes and that's fine. But it's to try and recognize what note you're playing and what you're changing to. So let's leave that practice there. Playing no valves, valve two, valve one, nice even pressure. Before you finish, one more C for me, will you? 
Very good.